connective tissue all the way down. This is not a muscle, the iliotibial band. There are some muscles up here that attach to it, the glutes and the uh, tensor fascia lata. They attach and they can tug on the top of this and then down here, along here, it lies on top of the quadriceps. Uh, so j that's just information. The fascia lata itself is not a muscle. Yes, yeah, so ligaments transmit, I mean ligaments direct and they create pathways and they transmit force and they're flexible. So bones are direct and transmit force and create pathways, but they're not flexible. So part of what this does, flexible but not elastic, right? The part of what makes it work is that it's not elastic. So that it, it keeps maintaining this idea of relationship. It doesn't just let things do this. So if it were bone, if this were bone, we wouldn't be able to move our leg like this, right? But we can, and we can move it a certain distance. And if I flex my knee, I'll be able to get more than if the knee is extended again. So, um, so ligaments do for us what bones can't quite do and they keep the direction going across a joint. In the paradigm of bones, for them to move, there needs to be a little gap between them, right? A little space between them so that they can articulate. Ligament can carry movement through it without there needing to be a gap. So the ligaments actually carry the information that the bones are carrying across a joint. They allow for some movement without, in theory, getting so movable that they can't do their job of transmitting force or directing things too.